Porkenstein, made by Catherine Lasky, illustrated by David Jarvis. Dr. Smartpig had no friends, and all his brothers were eaten by the big bad wolf. And it was the day before Halloween. He thought Sally, what fun is it to go out on Halloween without any friends? Dr. Smartpig was an inventor. He said I could invent a friend. So he ran down to his laboratory, and then he mixed some chemicals in a beaker, and then went to bed. At dawn, Dr. Smartpig raced to his lap. His beaker glowed. He invented a pigfish. He tried again, but made a pig bet. He tried one more time. It worked. He, he went to his lab and saw the biggest pig ever. But the big pig got very hungry and ate everything. He ate jars of jam and peanut butter. He ate every bit of food in the house. Then he ate the garbage with the can. And Dr. Smart Pig said, I didn't create a friend, I created a monster. It didn't take long for the stories to spread. Big Bad Wolf heard about the incredible hog. He began to drool at the thought. He said, yum, 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 what a meal. The Big Bad Wolf dressed up like a little old lady and knocked on Dr. Smart Pig's door. He thought he was a trick-or-treater. Then he realized he was the Big Bad Wolf and got scared. Will the Big Bad Wolf eat him? Read Porkinson to find out at the Link Library.